Cotecnia was acquired by Alstom back in October 2007. So it's been uh, quite an interesting process of integration ever since that has allowed us to be today where we are with the announcement of the offshore uh, market entry and the evolution of the Eco 100 platform ever since. You gotta think that Ecotecnia was a pioneer in the wind industry. The first uh, wind turbine generator erected in Spain uh, back uh, in the early 80s came from Ecotecnia. As a matter of fact, a lot of the team members from Ecotecnia are still part of my staff today. You can see them here in the, in the booth here today. We have equal interest uh, as a target. We do want to become one of the leaders in the wind business and the wind energy solutions. This means we, our product portfolio will have both emphasis on the onshore perspective. As a matter of fact, today we did announce uh, how we are upgrading our current Echo 100 platform, which is a three megawatt onshore platform, to cope not only with the class two and class three winds, but upgrading it to making class two, class three, and class one winds with an improve, a significant improvement in the yield, a range between eight and 15% improvement. That is just a demonstration on how we continue investing and in developing new products, more efficient products, reliable products in the onshore. Also, we are completing our portfolio of products by adding an offshore six megawatt direct drive turbine, which will be start being tested by the end of 2011. That means this same year. We also plan to have this offshore wind turbine be a second prototype erected by mid 2012 to have a, by 2013, hopefully our fleet ready for a demo project that we recently announced. We are in uh, discussions to be built together with Bell Wind in the coast of Belgium. So all of this to be ready for the market that we will be presenting a serial production wind turbine by 2014, which not by chance is time enough for the French tender, time enough for the UK third round crown estate. No doubt, this is, I think, part of a normal race that the entire wind industry has in being competitive with other forms of fossil fuels, more traditional and conventional forms of fuels. So it is one more contributor through the cost of energy reduction to become competitive in the wide scope of fuel and conventional fuels arena that we find in the world today. Will this provide more certainty to investors? No doubt about it. Uh, it is making uh, examples like in Turkey where you have already feed-in tariffs with R, which are at spot rate no different whether it's for the wind industry or for any kind of conventional fossil fuel. Having said that, that means that the current transition of the industry, and specifically today we have a good example of it with the upgrades of the Echo 100 and the 110 models, with this improvement in yield means that a cost of energy is being contained. The common thread in all our technological developments is an assurance on reliability. Assured through one common solid building block, which is what characterizes Ecotechnia and an acquisition. It's the Alstom Pure Torque. The Alstom Pure Torque is a unique and uh, proprietary design that allows on the onshore basis to divert the deflection loads into the tower away from the powertrain, specifically of the gearbox component, making it a much more reliable, a much more reliable wind turbine over the lifetime of its operation. This means that in most other cases, we don't need to replace any gearboxes during the lifetime of our onshore wind turbines. Instead, on the offshore basis, we have the same awesome pure torque design, which allows us to utilize very large generators, like the seven meter diameter generator from Convert team that we are introducing today in the show. And this same design will allow us precisely to provide the same reliability in a direct drive offshore wind turbine like the one we're presenting here today in Brussels. So again, one single common awesome pure torque design that is aimed into one thing, provide reliability.